what is the consequence of faulty or bad data in the case like a census? Because decisions, big decisions, huge monetary decisions into the future are made on that data, right? What happens if, even if it's a little bit wrong? Well, if you think about it, we've got 200 billion of infrastructure being spent around New Zealand in the next 20 years. If you misplace, say, 10% of that, that's 20 billion, well, it means you only get 180 billions worth of infrastructure for 200 billion. Who's going to pay the 20 billion that we never used? If you look at climate change, we're seeing all sorts of things occurring around New Zealand with emergency management. We need to have access quite quickly to tie in information about place. Our population projections now have to recognise that rather than everywhere in New Zealand, as they did 50 years ago, gaining from the baby boom, now different parts of the country are ageing faster, different parts of the country are getting a lot of migrants and some aren't. You know, 45% of population growth in the next 20 years is people 75 and over. So you imagine if you're building houses, just how many three-storey townhouses can we build for this population? So that's another important area. Thank you.